have managed to speak to him and uh, he said that he was uh, going for dinner and he went to pick up uh, uh, Barbara to go for dinner and she came out of the house he said come inside and she said uh, she said come inside i want to show you something she does some house renovations and he just got out for a minute he left the car running car keys were inside the car house keys everything and he went inside both doors were open of that house front and back and then they just uh, start these men ran in to the house and started uh, beating him up tasering him and then they tied him to a wheelchair they gagged his mouth covered his head and put the whole wheelchair in a boat when they were they, when they initially came and started you know shouting at him they said we are from the police there were indian accents and antiguan accents and they said we are taking you to st john's police station on the boat they tortured him and uh, they abused him mental torture electric shocks everything and the boat was taken to um, somewhere near karib port somewhere near there in dominica after that uh, this narendra singh called and talked to my husband and told him not to mention anything that had happened in jolly Har- harbor and uh, to not to mention uh, the lady barbara's name at all and to be very clear that when the judge uh, asked him he is to say that he is willingly going back to india he was in a horrible condition by now bleeding and battered and his eye was like there was blood in his eye and everything you know because he'd been beaten very badly and the electric shocks and they were cigarette they were burn it, burn you know burn karte the and uh, so then on the beach when he got there the uh, assistant commissioner of police uh, or commissioner of police we don't know and some policemen were waiting he got got onto the shore and the police commissioner uh, whoever was there and that man said that you have you are being uh, you have a red corner against you and you are being uh, arrested and you will be sent back to india uh, he he again insisted he had been kidnapped and he needed medical attention and legal aid but they said no and they put him onto a bus uh, a, a police van bus and they took him to the police station we are considering appealing to the queen who is the head of state uh, it is appalling and we are hearing that uh, people also are appalled with the the decisions and that are being taken
hundred percent. All three nations seem to have been involved because my husband was enjoying the protection of the law in Antigua, and the only way that uh, India could get him was to do something like this to claim that he had run and that uh, he was an absconder from Antigua, and uh, Dominica should return him to India.